we're here in Ireland. We made it. We're in Dublin right we're now. We're in our campsite. We're at a campsite. flew in a couple hours ago. We were looking how to get on the bus to get here. Somebody who was sitting next to us struck up a conversation, asked, you know, where are we going, that, that sort of thing. And so we started talking to him and he was a really, really nice guy and he ended up offering to drive us. And so we were talking for a while and we said, yeah, sure, that would, that would be awesome. You know, it's yeah. only a 30 minute drive as opposed to a, an hour and a half bus ride. Yeah. And he was the nicest guy in the so, world. So nice. Yeah. We're gonna chill for a little bit and then we're gonna hop a bus and get into, uh, get into Dublin. So apparently mixed drinks and cans are a thing here in Ireland. I love this place. <laughs> Now I want to make chicken. And Let's go. the best place to have a McChicken, of course, the Golden Arches. Let's go. <sighs> long day. Good long, day. Long day. Long day, good day. But good day. We've met so many people from other countries. I'm so happy. Good morning. morning. <laughs> it's Sunday. And tonight's our first night staying in a hostel, so we're pretty excited yeah. about that. That's gonna be fun. Yeah. Now we're gonna be staying in the heart of the city, and it's gonna be so much easier to get around to see everything that we wanna see and uh, explore. So uh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm crossing the street. Safety first. Safety first. Oh, doggy. Apparently, our card is no good for cash back, so now we're stuck with coffee with all of our crap and still no bus fare. <laughs> <laughs> we're still walking. We're gonna try and get that that fare now. So we were just walking uh, to find our bus. We finally got a uh, bus fare and uh, we came across this random place and uh, it was really pretty and it was really interesting. So we kind of just stopped and looked at it and we were about to walk on and then uh, a woman uh, came up and asked if we knew about it. Just some, just someone walking down the street. She was like, hey, do you know, uh, do you know anything about this? And we said no and so she started to explain it. Uh, and so it was just really cool uh, that somebody came and uh, explained this to us. Uh, basically she said what it was, was it was for uh, St. Bridget. And I guess uh, it, it, there are a bunch of these around Ireland. They date back, I guess, thousands of years, she was saying. Yeah. And she said before it was St. Bridget, it was uh, goddess. goddess Bridget. Uh, so it must have been a uh, Celtic thing. Uh, so anyways, um, this here, uh, people believed, believed or possibly still believe that it uh, cures blindness. What was it about this tree? People would tie they ribbons. Pray. They pray and then yeah. they tie ribbons on the tree. Yeah, exactly. So we're just out exploring Dublin right now. We've uh, we've explored it. This is our third time. Yeah. Third day out here in Dublin. Yeah. And yeah, this is just a really beautiful city. feeling about Dublin is it's not that there's like one thing that you have to see in Dublin or there's one thing that you have to do in Dublin. So far for me what's been awesome is just I've been exploring and going out and drinking in whatever pub looks cool. All right so uh, now we're uh, here checking out the Book of Kells and uh, we met up with my friend Sean. Sean! Exploiting. So yeah, so we met up with my friend Sean and sadly we weren't able to record much at all uh, with him. 
we spent a good deal of time with him and uh, he showed us around and showed us how little we planned oh, Dublin. Yeah. Uh, it's so, severe. Yeah, it's, itucks it's because there there's a lot, of, a lot of really cool places to see, a lot of museums. Mm -hmm. And so we were going to go to the museums and they are all closed on Mondays. Every single museum, every single free museum is closed on Monday. So if you want to come to Dublin, you want to come and see free museums, don't try and do it on Monday. Yeah. So now we're just on our way back to the hostel and we're going to take it easy. Dublin uh, so far has been great. A lot of walking, kicking my butt. I'm ready to relax, maybe pop a movie in later. And yeah, just see what, see what the day takes us. What are you Googling? I'm trying to figure out how to make meatballs, bake meatballs. Did you almost drop our meatballs? Oh, yes. Out of the city and into the wild. We're going down south, southwest, deeper into Ireland. About to catch our bus. Let's go. Now we are in Killarney. <sighs> it's gorgeous out it here. It is a beautiful, beautiful uh, town, city. I think it's a town. Yeah, we're just kind of heading southwest through Ireland. We wanted to not only just explore Dublin, we wanted to explore some of the countryside as well. And so we are going to camp uh, here in Killarney uh, because there's a national park and there is a castle. We set up camp in Killarney and uh, it was really funny. We were walking down the street and everything was like a super expensive B&B. Alisa pointed out that we feel like even more like barbarians because um, we're, we're ill prepared for this meal. We had some uh, pasta that we cooked in the hostel, but we don't have uh, any utensils or bowls or anything on us. So this is what we're doing. Yeah, get some with some sauce. Uh, <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. This is who we are. It's okay because we have baby wipes. On to the castle. Where is the castle? <laughs> Where is the castle? I don't know. That way. I think the castle's that way. It's starting to rain. Yeah. Part That's of the, okay. Part of the backpacker deal. Damn it! Ah! Ah! Of course it's temporary. Why wouldn't it? Uh, we're on our way to see this castle and really excited. Yeah, I've never seen a castle before. Really excited to see a castle, which is kind of, it's, yeah, we've never seen castles. It was really funny when we met up with Brett's friend. Sean. He's like, Sean, he's like, you guys have never seen a castle without one in my backyard. on the Travel Diaries. I met uh, Howard and Simona. They offered to drive us out here and, uh, and here we are. These uh, fossils are around 350 million years old. We uh, made it to the ruined castle, Valley Caveri. We um, biked with our friend Merrick here. Merrick. This is Jack and James. They invited us out to go surfing and it was, uh, it was an offer we couldn't refuse. So we're just uh, exploring this uh, abandoned castle. <laughs>